Hey guys, so Canva just got a huge upgrade and you're not going to believe some of the amazing features they added. So whether you're a business owner or a content creator, these new tools are really going to take your designs and videos to the next level. So in this video, I'm going to guide you through the most exciting upgrades and show you how to use them. I don't want to waste your time, so let's jump right in. Guys, I'm obsessed with this first new feature, let me show you. So first open your canvas and click on apps. Then search for mockups. So you know how Canva used to only have photo options for mockups? Well, now they added videos too. So click on videos. And you can find so many cool options here from phones, laptops, iPads and also products like t-shirts, cups, books and so on. So it's a really cool way to showcase your product or a digital product or even a website with services if you have a service based business. So just pick one and click on it. And then just drag a photo to where this green frame is. Then just wait a few seconds and boom. How cool is this? So at the moment we can only add photos though, but hopefully they'll add the option for us to add videos as well. Alright, so this next new feature is one of my favorite ones. And it's actually for editing videos. So drag your video to your canvas, click on this arrow icon and you're going to see highlights here. So what this does is it actually detects the most interesting parts of your video and creates short clips out of it. So for example, if you have a long form video like a podcast or a YouTube video, this feature will automatically cut out highlights and create shorter form videos you can use for your reels, TikToks or shorts. So you can check them out and choose either all of them or just one depending on how many you like. Pretty cool, right? Alright, so now let me show you another cool new feature, but this one is actually for audio. So if your video or audio has some background noise and it's just not clear, try Canva's one-click vocal enhancer to automatically remove noise from your voice recordings with speech enhancement. You can find this feature by clicking on the video, then click on these little arrows here and voice enhance. So by clicking this button, this feature is going to instantly improve your audio by eliminating background noise and balance sound levels. So just click on it, wait a few moments and AI will improve your audio big time. This feature is only available for Canva Pro accounts though. Alright, so now let's jump to the next feature. This one is really cool, you guys. So, you know how Canva has these green frames you can add to your design and insert your photo or video? So, these are really practical, right? But until now, there were limited options of frames. They've been adding more and more of these over time, but you still couldn't create a custom one. Well, now you finally can. So, to create one, go to Apps and search for Frame Maker. Then click on this one. So this gives you the option to create a custom frame by moving the borders. You can select a template and then customize it. When you're done, just click Add to Design and drag your photo or video on top of it. How cool is this? Alright, so now let's jump to the next feature that will blow your mind and that's Canva Courses. I just realized they've added this feature and I'm amazed. Alright, let's check it out. You can find this feature if you click more here on the dashboard and Courses. 
Then this new page opens up where you'll be able to change the name and then start adding lessons. So let's click on add activity and then you can either select create new or upload a video you've already created. Alright, so let me just add some random videos. And this is how you start building your course. You can also upload a cover image or create one in Canva. So right now this feature is made for more of an internal training. So for example, you can create a training and share it with your employees or something like that. But I really hope they expand this feature so that we're able to share our course with our audience, for example. Alright, so now let's jump to the next feature, which is especially useful if you use Canva to create graphics. So click on Elements and then scroll down to the AI image generator and click Generate your own. So until now there were text to image and text to video options here, which means you could write whatever you wanted and AI turned it into an image or a video. But now there's another option, text to graphics. So if you can't find the graphic you want in elements, you can just come here and come up with whatever you want and Canva will create a graphic for you. So let me show you how it works. So first you describe a graphic you want AI to create. Then pick a style. There are quite a few options here. And then click on generate graphics. Now we're gonna wait a few moments and Canva will give us four options. Pretty cool, right? All right, so now let's jump to the next feature, which you're gonna find pretty useful as well. So I don't know if you noticed, but most of the logos from brands were removed from the elements in Canva. So for example, if I go to the elements section and search for Instagram, None of the logos here are original, so I can't use any of these. So I'd have to go to Google and find a PNG, download it and then upload it to Canva, which can be really time consuming. But not anymore because I found an app inside of Canva where you can find logos from all types of brands. So let me show you where you can find it. Go to apps and search for brand fetch. Then just type in whatever brand you want and you'll find not just logos but also brand colors and some other brand elements you can use for your designs. Pretty cool, right? All right guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.